Hello and welcome back to Tammy's Antique Vintage Dolls and More. And today, um, I just made my, my first video. This is the second video that John and I were doing some talking. And he uh, we come to, like, we as we were talking back and forth, I came to this conclusion that a lot of the dolls that I have started, you didn't see from beginning to the end. And all I'll be doing is showing you the end result. So what I'm going to do is, is that only on camera, I'm going to work on one doll in front of you. And I chose the doll that I want to do. And she's sitting right here. It's this great big girl that I got back a little while ago. She, To me, she looks like a great big Patsy doll, but she isn't. But she's a beautiful old doll. Her, She does have eyes. I think they're in the back of her head down here. Uh, Celie Clems uh, was talking to me about this. She left a comment about her saying that... Um, the ones there were two versions of this doll one with the painted eyes one with the sleep eyes the sleep eye version she said is very rare she's never seen them she says she has painted the painted eye ones but never seen the ones with the um, sleep eyes so that's nice to know rare doesn't always mean that the doll is expensive it's just um, that she's a rare doll that's all it could be and but she's a great big long girl I think she'd be a great project for me to work on camera with you so every step of this doll We'll call this step one right now. I'm introducing her. And I will not do anything to her unless the camera's on me. And that's why I said to John, it'll have to be with the camera on me. And this will be a project that I'm going to um, do with you, with everybody out there. I'll show you how I take her apart every little inch of the way as I go through this. So it's going to be an interesting ordeal as I go through this, as you see everything. And um, I'm going to make mistakes in front of you. You're going to be able to see my mistakes. You're going to see the... The accomplishments I make at the same time, that's what doll restoration is about. And comment down below. Tell me what you would do instead I would do. I, I don't take that to heart. I love hearing it because sometimes it even corrects my steps. So I love to hear it as we go through this. So um, it, it's, it's all growth. My other dolls, I'm just going to work quietly on them and I'll present them to you when they're done. And on my own time type of thing. So this would be my, I'm going to call this my summer project. Even though it's not summer right now, I'm starting in the spring. But she'll be probably done by the, by throughout, the, somewhere in the summer, I hope, to see her done, dressed and looking beautiful. So this is what um, I'm going to be doing here. I hope you like this idea. Comment below if you like the idea. For seeing her from beginning to end. Um, her being restored. So have a great day. I got to get ready for work. Bye-bye.